Yay! <laughs> uh, I cannot explain the calm that comes comes over me when I can finally sit in this chair, and specifically for the good old pokes. I've been putting a, a lot of work into various things recently, and just the, the little respite of being able to have this colorful, ridiculous pokes challenge it's just it's just so nice but you may notice that we are not where we were at the end of the last part and that is because good old jay was being all nice and pointing out that the trainer school appeared to be a new area and i was investigating that and i don't think it is but I understand the confusion and kind of want your feedback. So you'll see a little banner pop up here when I cross into the trainer school. So all you see is R and then trainer school. Obviously that's not the, uh, the full banner there. Some of it's cut off and there's R, Hauli, O, where I have Route 1, Hauli outskirts. So, this, the trainer school is Route 1, and then the trainer school. And then this is Route 1, and then the outskirts. So, it's all still part of Route 1, so I don't think I can get an encounter there. So, I'm going to just keep moving on, kind of like I did before, which is probably why I didn't think to catch anything in that grass in the first place. But I did discover that th then Route 1 changes there to Holy, Holy City. It's hard to say. Um, so this area, I believe, would be fair game. And wouldn't you know it, there's some frickin' tall grass over here in the city. So we can get an encounter around here. Um... So I think we're going to just start off with that because last part was a bunch of tutorial madness, but we should be right at the end of it. So I think we can get an encounter here and probably soon on Route 2 at least, which will be fun uh, after taking on Team whatever they are. <laughs> um, so what I want the feedback on is playing and capturing a 3DS game uh, on PC obviously is a little weird in terms of the layout format, which is why some of that stuff is cut off for you. I think I've struck a pretty good balance. Like, the the way I see it, there's actually, like, the second screen um, kind of in the bottom right that I have looking prettier for you all as well. Um but I know, like, now upon looking at it, like, the route names and stuff are cut off, which I, that's not really that big a deal. And I can always just read them out um, to make it a little clearer now that I know that's a thing. The thing I, I had noticed before and I don't love is that the um, enemy Pokemon levels are cut off as well. That You guys can't see those. Um so, just let me know. I can try and shifty-shift some of uh, the layout here if needed to better accommodate your viewing pleasure. Um, there's no perfect solution, I think, especially with, like, uh, switching to the bag and viewing the items. I have a really weird setup between OBS and... Uh, the emulator, making that run in a way that I'm happy with, uh, that kind of limits things as well. Um, so I think it's a decent balance. There's not a perfect solution, but if those things are important to you, just let me know and I can try and work on it. But without further ado, 
I think we can go in here because we'll get a little ID item. Oh, <laughs> and hopefully get a fun, fun friend here. Let's actually uh, see who's in the lead. What does Hanley know? Right. Hanley's got paralysis. How do I switch? Which button is Y? Square is Y. Um, so that'll help. And I think Hanley's just weaker overall, which is good in this case. Um, because we don't want to kill it. Oh, I was going to do the item first, but fine. Wow, that sounds pretty cool. Hopefully that's not another, not another legendary. Uh, ooh, what do, what do you think that is? Fire? Hmm, Metacham. Not fire. Not that cool, but not uncool. I don't know if this is psychic or fighting. Kind of a creepy guy. A weird lips. Um, <laughs> but I don't anticipate too much trouble here. So let's just hit him with an absorb. Bide. Oh, God. I don't like that. Okay, that's good. I didn't do much damage to him. Uh, so for those of you who might not know, Bide just like it does reflecty damage based on how much damage he takes. So I'm going to try and paralyze, oh gosh, here. I don't think Bide will kill, yeah, based on my low amount of damage I dealt to it. Okay. So when you're faster and you hit him with a move beforehand, and then they use Bide, it can be scary because you, don't, you can't control it. You've already done damage to him. But... Oh, look at that, actually. I can just throw a Pokeball with Square? I don't even have to go to the bag? What? That's awesome. <laughs> Let's see if we can catch this guy now that he's paralyzed. I don't want to mess with Bide. Shouldn't have too crazy of a catch rate. All right. What the heck was that? Ooh. Okay. Uh, how much damage did that do? It should be fine. For another one. Then we might either have to potion or switch out to Nickwick. Boom! Metacham. Never used Metacham. Never used basically any of these, but <laughs> have very low knowledge of what Metacham even is. It looks like maybe it's a fighting type. I think I've mistaken it for Psychic before. Would you like to give Metacham a name? Yes. So we got Nick, we got James. Uh, let's see, it's a female. I don't think I really take that into account, do I? And I wish I knew what type it was. Pause. Unpause. All right. So I was actually right and wrong. It is both psychic and fighting. So that's pretty cool. Um, and for the name, I think we're going to go with Brecht <laughs> for Brett Holscher, a loyal... Uh, emoji reactor in the discord to <laughs> to me posting these vids i appreciate you watching brett i, I hope you find it fun uh and it, this is it sounds like brett and it's like wrecked wrecked <laughs> there you go i think he's this is i think metacham's a pretty cool guy okay uh, let's actually go take a look at what he's about. Of course, we paralyzed him, so we gotta get that dealt with. Doesn't have a held item. Seems like the odds on that are fairly low. 
Um, so as we knew, nose bide, meditate. I don't think we saw him use that. Confusion, he did. Oh, I guess we can tell by the PP he did use confusion. And detect, which I don't think is much of anything. So bide. User endures attacks for two turns and strikes double damage. Yeah. So it's kind of scurry. Uh, meditate. User meditates to awaken power deep within its body. You raise attack. Meh. Hmm. Uh, confusion does pretty good psychic damage. And then detect. Evade all attacks. For how long? Probably not too long. It's probably like something you use if like they're charging up or something. Mm. Uh, oh wait, what was his ability? Wrecked has stake out, which doubles the damage dealt to the target's replacement. Does that mean our boys get more damage or doubles the damage dealt to the target's replacement? Target switches out. No, it's probably, it's probably not terrible. <laughs> and doubles damage if we switch out. Uh, if it did, somebody's going to die from that probably. But I think it's probably uh, other trainers. So that's cool. We got, a, we got our encounter for Holy City. Let's go ahead and heal Brecht up. Get that little little tree tree gang tree trio gang and yeah uh, hmm. hi <laughs> I wanna I wanna explore the city let's let's go ahead and make sure there's not much more tutorial left and with that we're gonna want Brecht in front. I uh, gotta remember the controls. Go here. I guess we can probably give Brecht an item as well. I think we probably only have Orin berries. Oh, nope. That's one time. Dang it. Uh, metal powder. Held by Ditto. Duskstone doesn't evolve. Scissorite. That fossil. Uh, yeah. Wait, what was that? Oh, that was the water type move. Uh, give him a berry, just in case. And then we can go fight Team Skull, I believe they are. Yeah. And make sure there's not much more tutorial. I want to look around. It's also interesting that there's this cop here, and he just does not care about these uh, ne'er-do-wells three feet to his right. I guess they're kind of just dancing right now, but... Yo, check out I can change the game with my mad Pokemon skills. The reason I kind of like exploring the cities is because they can give TMs and stuff. Um, also, I feel like it's kind of a part of it. I don't know. I like it. Hopefully it doesn't make things too long and boring for you. <laughs> Challenge by Team Skull Grunt. So are there two Team Rocket Boys? Pidgey. Oh, scary. Uh, in this game, there's like the stormtroopers and then these guys. Level nine Pidgey. Uh, I'll try and try and call that out as well. Uh, probably no reason not to use confusion because that had pretty good power. So it is, same attack's fine. Uh, it is one level higher than me. Uh, but that shouldn't be an issue. Sand attack again. Just going to make me miss all of these confusions, unfortunately. Oh boy. My accuracy, I think, now is as low as it can go. Maybe one more. Going to peck me now? Oh my gosh. Gust. Hmm. Flying super effective against fighting, huh? All right. Well, between that and the fact that I can't hit this thing anymore, I guess... Flying's good against grass, too. Guess I'll send a Nickwick. 
You didn't uh, get too long in there, Brecht, but at least you'll get some leech XP. Electric Surge is so pointless. Gust should be fine against Nickwick. Yeah. He does not care about such things. And let's do oh, Ember, I think, was higher power. Yeah. Okay. You got nothing, Team Skull. What else you got? Lediba. Just fine. That was an interesting ball he had there. It was like camouflaged. I wonder if that's just because it's like an additional random boy. Probably should have switched in. Is Lidibuff flying too? It could no flying moves. I was going to say uh, Brecht, but you know. For real, over already? Receive some money. No fair, I was playing a different game. I was playing Roblox. <laughs> Let's get up out this port, B. <laughs> Nobody has to know about this. I like that he's calling him B and he's Grunt A. We don't need to whack little amulets anyway. We wouldn't even take them if you gave them to us. Okay. See you, boys. Those Team Skull jerks really must uh, have too much time on their hands, yeah? But keeping other people from doing our island challenges isn't going to just make it like they managed to finish theirs, you know? I already went down to the marina and screamed out over the ocean, Watch out, world! Someday I'm going to beat even my old gramps at an all-out serious battle. So maybe I'll go try to find some more totem stickers next. See you around. I don't understand what those totem stickers are. Uh, this person, I'm sure, had a voice. I think it was something like... What a lovely battle you showed us there against Team Skull. My thanks to you and your Pokemon. Why don't I heal your team to express my gratitude? Should have healed how? He helps. I must admit I've been wondering about you since I saw you at the trainer school. Professor Kukui brought you along and you and your Pokemon seem to defeat our teachers so effortlessly. Very well then, allow me to see if you're ready for my trial. Seems premature. Behold a magnificent Pokemon of the one and only Captain Alima. Alrighty. Hopefully she's not too... Mm, oh boy. For her Pokemon. Another Pidgey. Not too scared of the bird. Though granted, again, Brecht is probably not the one to take this challenge on, especially when it's a level 10 Pidgey. So Nickwick is coming back in. Alrighty. You really don't want me to hit you, Pidge. Alright, I want to see... For sure... If Smog or Ember does more. 40... Okay, 30, and it's less likely to hit, but it does have the poison. Chance, anyway. Of course, Ember's got the burn chance, so I think Ember... Especially being same type. Oh my goodness. With the accuracy, though, uh, is a better bet. Better, better bet. It's gonna take three. And that's if I hit all of them, which is a big if, given I've been pocket sanded. Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think we're good to tank one more, then potion up. Uh, okay. Electricity disappeared. Meh. I would like to finish this out. My accuracy can't go lower, right? Really? Oh, gosh. Okay. Hmm. I wanted to finish this out with Nickwick. Um, so. I wouldn't have anybody else's accuracy get lowered. 
Which I'm still going to try to, obviously, because I've potioned up, but... We'll see if I'm... Oops. Don't go to the bag. If I'm able to actually hit anything. You nope. Now my accuracy can't go lower, right? Really? What is that? Six or seven times? Hey! Thank you, Nickwick. <laughs> of course, in set mode, we're going to have to... Hey, Brick got, got the ding. Uh, Dig's again. Fortunately, we don't know any fighting moves. But... I think we're good to get Brecht back in. We are going to take a hit, of course, which is what I was saying. But it shouldn't be too big a deal. Let's see. What is this Zigzagoon's level? <laughs> what a cute animation. Level 10. We're level 9 as of recently. You know, I'm actually going to bide here, I think. Maybe it's dumb, but I feel like I'm... Hopefully it actually hits me. Uh, I feel like I never... Okay, cool. I mean, it's only going to do double damage of a tackle, which is, like, useless, I guess. What? What is dazzling? There goes the Orin Berry. How much does that do? That's a pretty good heal. Okay, well... Obviously, I couldn't have known that ability was a thing. Um... Yeah, I guess it's just confusion. Yeesh. Yeah, it'll be nice to have a fighting. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and potion. We got a decent chunk of them. It'll be nice to have a fighting type move, though. Um, just because I feel like a lot of things are normal type. <laughs> Hopefully, Brecht. Nice. I didn't, I didn't even know Confusion could do that, which it's called Confusion. Probably should have known. Cool. Um, I feel like Brecht. Ah. We'll learn one before, oh my goodness, a lot of healing. Before too long, hopefully. Seems unnecessary, but okay. Just keep on missing. Thank you. Crit? No. Don't love how many um, debuffs we're getting here with the... With the accuracy and defense down. But if we can hit this last one, that'll be half the squad. Okay. And Hanley is still fully good to go. Level on Nickwick. Faint attack. Is that dark type? Yes. 60, never misses. That's good for how his accuracy is right now. Um, lowers accuracy, lowers defense. For the most part, I think we're going to be using special attack things on Nickwick. So we're probably fine to get rid of Lear. It's not like I would use that very often anyway so that's some good type coverage uh dark i think is good against psychic maybe something else poison okay so i believe poison is good against we actually might be quadruple weak to poison as brecht um, so, let's see. P 
poison flying, so it's got to be Nickwick. Even though he's not great on health. Level 10 Zubat. <laughs> At least we got the Electric Surge back. Interesting. Should be fine even if we hurt ourselves in confusion. Pop off Faint Attack. Nice. Yeesh. Nice. Not a ghost type. But, okay. Again, that did nothing, so hopefully good if we hit ourselves. Eh. Whoo! That did more than I wanted it to. Okay. Um. Let's just go ahead and push. Let's see. Is that the wrong thing? Yes. Don't really want to risk anything right now. This early on. <laughs> no reason to take our squad down by 50%. We're still confused. Yes. Got him. Okay. One more. Let's see if it's her ace. Electricity disappeared. Skitty. Eeky skitty. Pressure. Don't know what that means. Um, let's go ahead and get Hanley in here just to split some XP. I don't think there's any help with typing here, but again, just splitting XP. Um, yeah, so level of and skiity. Yeesh. Let's absorb after that. Wow, okay. Nice. Uh, let's try Stun Spore, see if we can reduce some damage from this thing. So the level 11 does look like it's the ace for this captain. Uh, it's fairy wind. Try and get some more damage. <laughs> wow, that is not much damage. I should have paid attention to how much that did. Uh, hmm. I think with the healing from the absorb, we'd be fine as long as it doesn't crit. But who else we got in the back? I mean, it's paralyzed as well. <laughs> I think we can do it. <laughs> Not fully, uh, as Cottony Hanley here. But... We would have to get unlucky for this to kill me. Sing. Especially when it puts me to sleep. Alright. With that, we have to switch out. Um, and I don't know that I feel comfortable... Putting... Brecht in there given the level differential. So, uh, this thing may even be fairy, I'm not sure. And I'm not sure if dark is good against fairy, so time to do some research. Oh, look, electric surge, how? <laughs> Maybe if we get an electric type Pokemon. Yeesh. Uh, this will be more helpful. Like we can use them as little combo bros. Let's see, 21 to 12. So nine damage. Again, it would only be a problem if it crits. Is it stupid not to use a potion? 
I mean, it's paralyzed, and it would only be a problem if it crits. I'm not going to kill it here. Okay, I am going to kill it here. <laughs> All right. I just don't want to super potion everybody out. Um, I want to I wanna make it fair, as it were. Uh, you, or should I say, you and your Pokemon make quite the interesting team. I do hope you'll come to Verdant Cavern and attempt the trial, the trial of Alima. Didn't I just do the trial, really? How is it any different? You can get there from Route 2. That Rotom Dex of yours will show you the way. I bid you Alola. Thank you, Alima. Why didn't you heal my Pokemon after this fight, though? Okay. I want to look at what the sticker is. <laughs> okay. Also, I just remembered I never got that item. What is the point, though? Do I need the stickers to do the challenge or something? What is this? City Hall. Alright, so I'm just gonna go heal up my friendy friends real quick. I lied. Can I get through here? No. Without going through the grass. What we got? Meh. Berry. Alright, anything else we could have gotten here? That's pretty cool. Um, let's see, what level is that? Level 9. Tropius. Seems like maybe a flying grass. Uh, I'm just going to run away from this for now. Um, we kind of got that covered a little bit with Cottony, so I'm fine with um, Brecht here. So I'm just going to heal up. Uh, then that reminded me, I do kind of want to circle around to see what else we might have been able to get beyond, beyond Tropius and Brecht. Just because I think that's a fun little piece as well. What could have been. <laughs> but I also want to kind of see what's up in town. If you give your Pokemon medicine in the Pokemon refresh, you can cure your poisoning or whatever. Else might be ailing it. What a refreshing boon. This is awesome! We can trade Pokemon in no time at all using Quick Link. I don't think they're going to give me anything. Are you going to give me anything? Hey, you're a trainer, aren't you? Do me a favor. Sure. Well, I'm pretty relaxed and laid back. A bit too relaxed, actually. I may be wasting my life. <laughs> so I want to learn a more speedy way of life from a Pokemon. Uh, I've heard there's an Abra. Will you catch one? So I'll come back if I ever find an Abra. Hey, you! Do you know about the Totem Pokemon? That's not surprising. Do your trial, and you'll find out what a totem is. I would love to. You want a tip? Okay. Use a move that's the same type as your Pokemon. You can do extra damage. Uh, no. Who was I again? Oh, yes, I'm the move deleter. I can see that's good to know. Make Pokemon forget their moves. It is a bit of a sad life that this man doesn't know who he is, though. <laughs> Who are you? Oh, sticker. Two stickers. Who are you? A journey is made by those who travel with you, and compassion makes the world go round. Let me share that. Yes, with you, young trial goer. Hmm, heal ball. I'll take it. Pokemon you catch in a heal ball will have their HP restored to the maximum level. They are also cured of any status conditions they might have. That's useful. All right. So we got two pretty good encounters, uh, possible encounters in this little grass here. Muck. Meh. Yeah, I think between those, I would definitely would have rather had either of the friends we got. Again, we might be quadruple weak to poison. I feel like fighting or psychic or both which is quadruple, <laughs> is weak to poison. So, gotta be scared of that. More Tropius. I like his banana beard. I want a banana beard. This 
probably one or two more around here. See if we can get any sneaky peeves. Pretty common tropius. Have we seen another Brecht since then? I don't think so. I wonder what download is. Special attack rows. It's a pretty good ability. I wonder if Brecht evolves. It seems like Brecht would evolve. I like the name Brecht. <laughs> well done, me. Oh, goodness. Oh, there's a Brecht. All right. Maybe look at one or two more here. Brecht speed must be pretty good. Haven't had any trouble running away. It's good to know. Vanillax. You know, I of course always like ice type. It's my favorite type. Um, it's an ice cream cone. So, <laughs> yeah, uh, from what I saw there, pretty happy with Brecht. I think he provides good type coverage and everything, so that's nice. Ooh, an item back there. Petting a fluffy Pokemon is pretty much the best feeling ever. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm not wrong. If you cuddle with your Pokemon using Refresh, then they'll try harder for you in battle. Yeah, I'm not going to do that, though, is the problem. A nice cold Pokemon here in hot, hot Alola. I can't think of a more pleasing combination. That's kind of weird, lady. I didn't know this place was... Can I get down there? There's a sticker down there. Fishing rod. <laughs> Master ball. Odd keystone. Sounds cool. Probably some weirdly specific thing that I can't use, but it sounds cool. What is that? Lens case? Contact lenses. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> what does this Colbert, oh, Colbert Berry do? Uh, if held by a Pokemon, this berry will lessen the damage taken from one super effective dark type attack. How exciting. Didn't mean to close that. Uh, let's see. A vital item that is needed to keep a stone tower from collapsing. Voices can be heard from it occasionally. Yeah, so that's probably just some weird specific item from one of the other games that I can't even use here. Oop, sticker. Three totem st Uh, Let's see, what is this? Do I want to go in here? I'm going to go in here. Why not? Oh, hello, my champ. Champ! Yeah! Machamp here is a great helper. Sometimes Pokemons are good at things. Pokemons are good at things that people aren't, and the opposite is true too. What is this place? Any friend of my son's is welcome here. Stay as long as you'd like. Are you How's Dad, I guess? Hey. The young master is called the Prince of the Trainer School among some. They may think he looks princely, but if you knew the true Alima- Oh, that's a guy. You'd probably call him a fanatic more than anything. He's wild for battle. Would you care for a little treat from a far-off region, dear? Oh, nice. Lumio Skelet. Medicine. It's a kind of pastry from the region where my Alima went to study abroad. It's his favorite, you see. Alima gained as the captainship because he exudes pure skill. Seeing him is like uh, looking at myself back on stage and in the spotlight again. Hmm. I don't like you. <laughs> Thanks for the baklava or whatever. Alima got anything cool in his trash? Did I see anything up here? Oh, yeah. Some trophies. You can see your own face. Oop, a sticker. I really don't think these stickers probably have any purpose. But they make a fun sound when you look at them. <laughs> All right. Okay. Probably just check out one more place or so. 
Don't want to spend too much time looking around the city. You can heal your Pokemon and have effects like poisoning by treating them with medicine. What was this one? City Hall. Can I get like a permit? <laughs> Here, this medicine is for Pokemon. Take it with you for your travels. Revive. Useless. Keeping our city clean and supporting the folks who work at the Pokemon Center. Those are all things that City Hall handles, too. Oh, this guy's gonna have something. I'm busy thinking about what kind of city we should make our Howly into. It's got to be convenient for the people living here and for the Pokemon living here, too. Nope. We're going to have a friend. Nope. <laughs> I don't know where I got friendly from. We're going to have a lively home together with our ghastly, too. We're going to get married. We're here to apply for a marriage license. Oh, my. Looks like our battery stock is getting a bit low. I'd better put in another order from the fields. Yes, yes. I'll need some identification, please. Do you have a trader passport? Oh, so you shall. Yes, I remember preparing your trader passport for you. Of course, Professor Kuki asked me to. You're from Kanto. Is it true that Meowth from Kanto are different from Meowth here in Alola? You got anything for me? It's one of the jobs of City Hall to maintain the roads and make sure there's space for any ride Pokemon to travel along them, too. Nope. Ooh, another sticker. <laughs> Ribbons! They're like a way to wrap your Pokemon up in precious memories for perpetuity. I've heard that there are a lot of different kinds of ribbons in other regions outside of Alola. I'm sure I'll be back to this city. They said it was one of the biggest cities, so... Just wanted to tour around a little bit, get a little of a local flavor. <laughs> Can do... Oh. Just one little... What is that, though? Some cool arcade. Oh, photo club. No, thank you. East station? Yep. Uh, just kind of make sure there's no last, like, items I can grab here. I like Corsola. Before heading out to Route 2, I think. And, oh, there was one. Why does that look yellow? Let's just take a peek. Gonna have to go through some grass here. Looks like. If we can sneak on by. Ah, TM. Sludge Bomb. I'm sure that is a poison type. So we'll keep that in mind. In case we find somebody. Would have been cool to put that on Muck. But again, Wrecked is a nice member of the team. So let us head out. And with that, I'm almost certain he is. Yes, but make sure Brecht is in front. And... Oh, wait for me, John. What do you want? <laughs> oh, I'm glad to see a familiar face. I always get lost so quickly. I can't figure out the roads here. I can't even buy my own clothes. But you, you're moving on to your first trial. You're going to Verdant Cavern. I read something in an old book once. It said that the island challenges were once a journey made to prove yourself and gain the strength to battle against the guardian deities of Alola. Like Tapu Koko. The people in Iki Town said that Tapu Koko loves Pokemon battles, didn't they? If we could meet Tapu Koko once more, do you think we could find the answer to why it saved you and Nebby that day, John? Oh. Oh yes. Please take these, they're called revives. I really don't need those. If you use one of a Pokemon that's fainted, you're cheating. John, good luck with your first trial. I will hope that it goes well for you. Please let me leave. Please let me leave. 
There, Charlotte, I've got this ordinary creature calmed again for now. Want to give a, want to try giving a little pat again? That's the only way he'll get used to you. Pat it. Poor leg. Nope. Hook it on the nose. Boop. Really? You want me to grab it by the horns? That seems dangerous. <laughs> Maybe old Tauros here can feel your love. He sure seems happy to know you, and yet, it still seems to me like Tauros wants to stretch his legs on his own island challenge. Hi. What? You want to play tag now? The Miller Miller Coda never loses, friend. All right. Route two, here we come. So yeah, you can only see R there, but I assure you, as indicated by the sign, this is route two. What's up, sir? Be careful out there, young trainer. Haven't you seen the way the grass shakes on route two? That rustling grass hides a Pokemon that is dying to pounce on some easy trainer target. But battling those feisty creatures can be worth it. They sometimes drop items after battle. Interesting. Um, let's do it. I think we should get it before we probably jump into a few trainer battles here. So, Zip. that very much sounds like a water type. Let's see. Can I guess which one? No. Uh, a scavalier. It's not a water type. I believe a scavalier is a bug. Maybe bug ground, bug steel, bug rock. It might just be bug bug. Um, but I think it's fairly good. Um, it's level six. If it knows a bug type move, I think it will be a danger to Brecht here. So, let's see. Let's just be careful. Though I don't think we'd be able to weaken it like with anybody else. Uh, what moves does Brecht know? <laughs> I mean, this shouldn't do anything to it, right? Yeah. Peck is fine. Peck is not fine. <laughs> Flying fighting, right, okay. The heck was that? Oh. Maybe one more and then try and Throw some PBs at her. Hmm. Yeah, let's go ahead and switch into Nickwick now. Because I imagine that's enough to be able to catch our friend here. It certainly looks cool. Cool Lance Arms. <laughs> Lance Armstrong. <laughs> Uh, that was stupid. Uh, let's see if we can add this boy to the squad. To the squad. Nope. Heck. It's fine for real this time. Come on, buddy. Give us a couple shakes. Come on. Get in the bow. I can, of course, weaken it. Oh, boy. More if this becomes an issue. I was just wanting to switch out because of the leer, mainly. Um, 
Breck definitely could have survived a pe another pack a normal defense, but the Leer had me a little nervous. Huh. I'm almost certain anything Nickwick has would take this thing out, especially being double its level. Nice. Okay. I'm reasonably happy with that. I think of the bug types, it's one of the better ones. Level 10 on Brecht. Give a nickname to a Scavalier. Let's see. <laughs> I can't name it Lance Armstrong. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Um, it's like a knight. Like a pointy knight. Roman. I don't know why. But I feel like this one is one that Jay would like. So I took a while <laughs> to come up with a name for this one. But uh, I, I feel like I say this every time, but I like it. And it's going to be... Cruz Jader. <laughs> Cause it's kind of like a knight, like a crusader, crusader. Oh, it's fun. <laughs> Welcome to the team, crusader. Let's take a peek at what you got, huh? Uh, summary. We got Peck, as was seen. Leer, quick guard, which it used, but I didn't understand. Protect itself from priority moves. So I guess if it's got quick attack or something. Twin needle. So it does know a bug type. Uh, twice in succession. Two spikes. 25. So like 50 power bug type move. Doesn't seem too bad. Uh, so bug steel. That's interesting. Okay. I think this thing is supposed to be pretty defensive. So that might be nice to have somebody to switch into for emergencies um bug type is generally a little squishy so we'll see how that works in practicality um sure. let's go ahead and i guess just I mean, breck isn't too low but no don't be dumb <laughs> put hanley in front just because he's full health um just take a couple minutes here to look at what else we might have been able to get on route two manectric uh, it's fine uh i don't know i feel like um crusader slash uh, scavalier it has more flair to it than just an electric dog, so that's fine. Another Manectric. Don't really care. I don't really love Manectric's design. It's just this weird cone head. <laughs> so, yeah, I think I'd rather have Cruise Jader between the two, and I mean, you can't argue with that name. <laughs> Umbreon. I know you guys love Umbreon. I think it's one of the less exciting evolutions. We kind of already have dark type coverage a little bit. I mean, not really. Um, but with Nick Wick learning faint attack. So Growlithe would have been cool. And I think... It doesn't evolve into Arcanine unless you, like, do a trade. Um, but I think with my randomizer, I set it to make impossible evolutions like that possible just, like, by leveling a junk. 
So... I think mm, if we had gotten that, maybe we could have gotten Arcanine. So that would have been cool. cool, 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 cool. <laughs> but again, between what we've gotten with Brecht and Crusader. What on earth is that thing? Is that like the evolved form of Zigzagoon or something? Oh no, it must be the evolved form of Rockruff. Cause rock. Um Yeah, I'm good with what we've gotten today. See if there's anything else. Blissey. Blissey would have been pretty good just cause she real hard to kill. Um it would have been overlap with fairy type though, so. Yeah, I think we made out pretty well. All right, so with that, I've probably been going an hour or more again. <laughs> so we should probably cut it off there. Um, pretty good, pretty good stuff. Um, what items did we get? We got the uh, TM, so that was good. Uh, heal ball, I mean, nothing crazy, but I'll take it. And then some good encounters and are moving on to our first island challenge, it seems. Or trial, which precedes the challenge. That's a little weird structure, but whatever. So, looking forward to doing more. We'll see if we get a midweek madness going again or not. Uh, that is a coin flip at best. <laughs> but I'll be back next week, if nothing else. So, remember... A spoonful of peanut butter is worth every smile. <laughs> <laughs>